Hello, my crafty friends. This is Lori, Girl on the Ridge. I just have a quick video of some file folders that I made. This one, I'm, I have two. One already sold. This one I just listed. These are so fun, and <laughs> they're making me happy. So that's what we're going with. So everything is listed in the, um, the Etsy as far as the size and everything. So what we have here is... I have the envelope that we did the other night, and that flips open. There will be something in there. Then another envelope from In Love Arts. Then one of my snippets with an envelope that I um, decoupaged, or not decoupaged, um, oh, laid the die cut on it. There will be something in there, and then a pretty bag that I... Just a lot of vintage, uh, my vintage buttons, my, um, some of my calicos. So that is the front. I love these. Love them, love them, love them. And I got my new mat. The most, re the real, ugh, the real reason I got this mat is because my pink mat, all my numbers were worn off. And I really use this a lot. So let's hold, and the way I mix my glue and stuff. Oh my God, I'm such a slob. So I'm hoping this little uh, pad over here will help me. So over here, I decided to put another envelope flip with um, nostalgic graphic, I think. And then I made some really pretty tags out of my porch prints. And I printed these on glossy paper, back our tracing paper. I really love that print. And then I did an altar. There's a pocket behind, you just gotta be careful. There's a pocket behind this coffee filter. I yeah, just lift it up. And then this is a coffee filter. And then this is a just a little um, notepad with some really pretty pretties. And that goes in that. Then over here I made a little journal with wedding dress. And it's two envelopes with a little signature in it. And I think it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Yeah, ten, twenty, forty pages front to back to write in. There's some line paper, guest check. Just pretty, 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 pretty. And again, anything there's an envelope, I'll have a little surprise in there. So that is there. Then I did another little snippet. Just, well, if I... um. Stuff that just I just love the look of it. And if you've seen Roxy Creations, she had the haul from um, a flea market, the, the books that she found from late 1800s, early 1900s. Oh, my God, I was just in awe to think that the women back then were doing the same thing. You really have to go see her. It's Roxy Creations. I'll try to link it because I'm on my phone and I'm home today. So this is a little bag. And then this is a little... Um, little notebook so that's that and then over here is another oh no that goes this way this is just a flat or flip out or just a fold out and there's a little envelope here it matches and then some more of the wedding dress and a little piece of ephemera there and this is uh, sue olson this paper is so pretty that's my porch print and then with an envelope so this is the altar fire folder, and then there'll be a piece of sorry silk. And then back here, I just put some calico, and then I just made another big um, tag. It just sticks in there. And this comes with a... Oh, I sewed um, this pretty ticking type thing. This is new. And this is wedding dress. Um, or no, I'm sorry. This is just vintage um, lace. This, all this lace is from Crafty Me Shop, which I just got my package today, and it's incredible. This is actually a piece of tape that I know um, a lot of the girls are making it look old, but this was actually on it because I haven't attempted that yet. And then I just sewed a little thing that said vintage in the little pocket music paper. So this this is the one set that is I just listed. Now this other set is for Miss R. And this is already sold. So this one is, again, same, same style. 
but this one opens up. This is, let's see, I forgot. This is, oh, this is a bag. It's a guest check decorated on a bag. And then this is a piece of vintage lace in a tag, or in a envelope. And then this is another envelope. And then this is an envelope with my, uh, ooh, that's, that's loose, um, die cup of the fan. And then I'll put something in there. So that is the front. These are very, very relaxing to make. And then in here I did the little pocket from In Love Arts. I just put that in there. This is the little journal, vintage lace. I did some of the cutouts and the paper, and that tucks in here. Another envelope, another envelope, and a tea bag. So everything is just almost the same, but very different. Same muted colors. Then over here, the calendar and another tag. And over here is another, just a little scrappy book. And most of this paper is porch print, and I did um, print it on glossy paper. I just wanted a different look. I love the way the colors pop. And the back has a pretty a postcard. And then this envelope is, I'm going to glue that. Again, a lot of um, Crafty Me Shop trim doilies this is on a piece of paper cardstock and then i just pretty in there and then something will be in there so this i'll ship out this will go out monday miss r <laughs> and that is it and i will be right back because i am going to be doing a design team project craft with me on some farmhouse um, ephemera and she's uh, ephemera has got some really new papers and I printed them up and I'm excited because I just spent four hours cleaning my attic so now I'm done for the day and I want to play so I will be right back bye <laughs> 